what they have done symbolizes what we should all take as an inspiration. Let their actions inspire us all. Let their achievement of reaching the summit of Kilimanjaro remind us that as, South Africa, as a South African nation, there is no mountain we cannot climb and no peak we cannot reach. Mr. Ephraim Mafuru, do you see any advantage or any opportunity for such a group to summit at Uhuru Peak? Yeah, I think for me it's a very great honor to see a group of international people from more than 80 countries as they celebrate the International Mandela Day. They chose to come to Tanzania and summit the highest freestanding mountain in the world. And for South Africans and Tanzania, we feel so proud because our four founding fathers established our bilateral relations for more than 40 years that uh, our countries and have, have actually existed in this type of bilateral relationship. So the great uh, late Nelson Mandela and our iconic, the late Mwalim Nyerere, had some great relationship. Our current president, Her Excellency Dr. Samia Sulu Hassan, and His Excellency uh, President Ramaphosa have great relationship in terms of these great nations. So we feel proud to be part of bringing together the people from all eight countries with South African companies organizing this uh, visit. For us, it's a great honor to be part of this because they help to market Tanzania tourism in one of the tourism products called the iconic Mount Kilimanjaro. We need to all work together. So one of the things that we, I believe we are achieving a strike for Mandela, at the end of August this year, we would have brought, since 2012, we would have brought 400 people to climb Kilimanjaro through Trek for Mandela. So I'm encouraging South Africans to come and visit Tanzania, climb Kilimanjaro, get the experience of how it is, experience the hospitality of the porters. These people are amazing. I mean, they are super, super amazing. Kiweza kwenda maeneo mengi sana, lakini wamechagua kuja kwenye mlima Kilimanjaro. Kwa sisi kwetu, ni CM kubwa kabisa ya kujitangaza. Kwa kwanza tunafurai, kwa sababu tumepata nafasa kujitangaza, tumepata nafasi ya kuwambia ulimwengu wakati sisi pamoja kama wa Afrika tukisherehekea siku ya kuzaliwa tukiungana na wa Afrika kusini basi nafasi hiyo sisi tunaitumia kwenye utalii kuendelea kuutangaza kwa sababu sherehe hii imeenda kufanyikia kilele cha mlima Kilimanjaro hii inatusaidia zaidi kutambua mlima huu lakini kuendelea kuongeza wageni wengi zaidi wanaokuja kutembelea na kupanda mlima Kilimanjaro whoever goes to Uhuru Peak uh, always he or she comes with his story what is your story for me, my story is people should take the triumphs and the challenges that the Ilovo Sugar team faced on their way to the Uhuru Peak to inspire them to move mountains that probably are holding them back. Hii ni Kadoshi TV, always on time.